Hello everyone, General2 here, and welcome to Bounty Train. Uh, this is a uh, real-time RPG uh, based in the mid-1800s, centered around a train. It's great. So sit back, relax, and let's get started. Just gonna go on normal difficulty. He's already been struggling. Boy. All right, talk to Jeremiah. Uh, okay, so our father's a lawyer. Okay, he was murdered on the railroad. And they're building a transcontinental railroad. It's a big government project. And it looks like his associate wanted to build, a okay. It's always about money, isn't it? All right, so we just need to travel to Boston with this cotton. All right. Um, so our first contract completed. We need to go back to Portland now, but let's see if there's any contracts. Ah, that is more like it. I mean, not much. One unit of cotton to Portland, but what are you going to do? You need to keep an eye out for tobacco. Okay. Back to Portland. Middle of the night. There. Yeah, I'm here with that cotton. What do you need? All right, what's up, Mega Stuff? Are there any? Um, how would you know you got attacked by raiders, or how does that work? Uh, you'll see the first time it happens. It there's a uh, automatic. It happens every single time you go through a zone at the first time. All right, so we need to earn the money for a passenger carriage. That's $400. So let's see. There's three ways you can earn money. Contracts for freight through the town hall, uh, buying and selling through the market, and passengers once you have a passenger carriage. Oh, I leveled up. Um, so extra critical chance. Um, improving our special ability or agility, which is going to give us more reload speed and more evasion. I'm going to go with the plus one agility for now. Okay, so let's see. Four units of tobacco to Boston. Okay. And then, ooh, we got gems or jewelry. Gems, you say? Yes, gems. We'll be taking a chest of gems. Raiders are gonna want that. Yeah, well. Why are you calling them raiders? Clearly they're bandits. Whatever. Alright, here's your delivery. Thank you, have a nice day. And now we sell our jewelry. Okay, um, still got the tobacco contract, but that's just about it for, oh, we already have 400, all right, so we just need to find something that'll get us a profit back in, uh, Portland, so this is the, uh, price chart, it tells you the prices for different goods in every city you visited, cotton is not going to be that good of a profit, what about food, nope, food's going to be a loss, Tools. Ooh, we are definitely going with tools, unless medicine's worse. No, going with tools. Back to Portland. You didn't have anything for tools, did you? No. Okay. Nice. Nice. That's a lot of money. 
All right, Jeremiah. So, if we scroll to the other side, here is the depot. This is where we get new trains, repair our trains, etc. So, we just need a small passenger carriage. So we're going to buy that for 400. All right. All right, now we're going to New York. So let's go to the town hall. And we don't have enough reputation for those contracts. Okay. Now, anyone else? Okay, no passengers at the station. And we got no intel on what will sell well in New York. That being said, we could stop in Boston, make some money. Um... Yeah, we'll uh, grab all the gems we can afford, which isn't that much, and sell them in Boston for a little bit of money. There, had to get those away. All right, let's sell the gems here. Make sure we got no contracts going to New York from here, which I think we do. Yeah, we do. Four units of food to New York. We'll take that. Any passengers here want to go to New York? No. Okay. And we leveled up again. Um, I think I'm going to go with agility again. And on to New York. We got to get there fast. One day, 19 hours. Perfect. Alright, here's your letter. Alright, this is what the screen looks like when you're getting attacked by bandits, but um, I'm not getting attacked by bandits, it's just a uh, tutorial, basically. Fall steam ahead! Shovel call! It up. All right, so this is the regulator, but if you see the red, um, if the uh, gauge goes past the red, it starts damaging my train. Dang. Oh shoot, we gotta slow down. Stupid turns. I need a faster train. This train's so slow. Why are you suddenly playing it? Does that mean that like an enemy train's gonna pop up? But... No. Like, like this is just a tutorial. But there's okay. So basically, there's random encounters in this game. That's how bandits work. Alright, so we need to go here. Here's your four units of food. Have a nice day. And urgent letter. Where's the post office? Here it is. Hang on, what? Oh. There we go. Now we need to talk to Jeremiah.
Ugh. He's making me subscribe to the newspaper. But basically what newspapers do is keep us up to date on market prices for goods in cities. Um, so it's pretty useful. Uh, now we need to talk to Jeremiah. Jeremiah. There he is. All right, Buffalo. We need to go to Buffalo. All right, now this is the major plot of the uh, story, is we need to beat, beat this guy to 50% shares uh, so he doesn't take control of the company. So that involves traveling all across the United States. All right. So before we really head out there, we need to hire another guy to our party. Um, extra damage, extra strength. That's more base health, melee damage, and throwing range. Right, let's improve Gunslinger. Okay, so we got how much money? Yeah, we got plenty for that. And then, let's see. Let's see. This guy is a fire... Yes, we need the firefighter. We, we need the firefighter. Now, we need to go to Buffalo. Which is right here. Let's see. Okay, so we can go there without costing anything. Sweet. Let's see. Do we have any contracts to Buffalo? We do. Nice. And we got a pasture we can take to Buffalo. I'm liking this. I am liking this. All right, so let's open up the line. And let's travel to Buffalo. Boy. What? What happened? Boy. What happened? So, you think you're just gonna go take my money, huh? Yeah, about that. What happened? Someone's attacking you? Yeah. Oh, my pastor doesn't have a gun. He doesn't have a gun. Whose bright idea was that? Mm. Well, that was easy. Just two robbers. Rip robbers. But it, it eventually gets a lot more challenging. And by that I mean you need mortars on flat cars to deal with shit. Because you can, you can mount Gatling guns and mortars on your train. Alright. Uh, so that might just be overkill. It's not though. That's that's the thing. It's really not. All right, let's go with kung fu. Evasion's good. All right. So now in cities where there are hospitals, you can uh, have your uh, party members heal up. But I'm not going to do that right now because it takes time, and Walter's not that bad. Uh, Why did I come here again? Oh yeah, I'm looking for Robert. Ooh, thanks to the Harris Treaty, Japan has finally opened its ports. As a collector of exotic, I have purchased several crazy Japanese trinkets, but the train carrying them is raided by bandits on its way here from Philadelphia. Okay, so no time lay on this one, just Nick, whenever we make it to Philadelphia. Okay. Uh, who's Frank? Hmm. <sighs> <sighs> What's the matter with this guy? All 
All right, then. Um, well, then, I guess our next stop is Philadelphia. Let's see. So we'll go back to New York first. No good contracts back to New York. One passenger, though. Let's see. What else sell in New York? Um... Jewels, no. Medical supplies, no. Food. Food will definitely sell in New York. Back onto the high iron. Actually, let's make sure there was no contract for it or anything. No. So, no contracts. Oh, we can take fur to Boston, but we're not headed to Boston. We're headed to Philadelphia. No passengers at the station either. Ugh. Mm, it's going to cost us money to open that line. Let's run back up to Boston. Okay, two more slots. What would sell in Boston? Tobacco. All right, we'll take tobacco back up to Boston. All right. Four units of tobacco, you say? Well, I've got two. That's right. Put them in storage for you for now. I'm sure we'll have more tobacco around here eventually. They don't depreciate over time. All right. Well, now we're traveling twice the distance with nothing. Oh, well. Nathan scrubbing out again. To Philadelphia. Welcome to Philly. Alright, who do we need to talk to? All right, we need to bring these back to Buffalo now. Um, anyone else want to head that way? Nope. Okay, um, what'll sell in Buffalo? Cottonwood? What about tools? Tools it is. All right, back to Buffalo we go. Boy. You getting raided again? Yeah. Light him up!
This train's so slow. You're so slow. Sandro, stop shoveling coal and start shooting. Oh crap. Put out the fire! How are you on fire? Bullets light things on fire. Alright, Standro, start shooting again. Seriously, another fire? Come on! Walter, next time you're driving, Sandro's firefighting. This is bad. My beautiful passenger carriage! Has it burned to the ground yet? It's pretty close. Reload! Boy! Nathan's getting cucked again. I can't believe that happened. I'm super salty now. Oh, cool, I'm going over a bridge. Oh. I lost my freaking caboose. No! Nathan, you're just being a scrub. Clearly, I'm being a scrub. But we aren't going to talk about it. Okay, Buffalo Yuka. Alright. Well, guys, like most of my games, and uh, Vanguard off to a bit of a rough start, but things are going to be fine. Everything's going to be fine. Appreciate, appreciate you guys watching, and I'll see you next time.